Alright old school gamers, here's the build of the old droid XU4 in the old GST gaming console case. Putting this guy together wasn't hard, but a heads up, there's no manual for the case build. Alright old school gamers, let's get started. All you're going to need is a small Phillips screwdriver for this build. You'll be mounting the old droid board inside the top half of the case and secure it down with four screws. The screw mounts may be tight, so thread them first before actually mounting the board. Next we will connect the ribbon cable to the 30 pin header port on the old droid board. Then, we will connect the USB cable to the LCD screen module. Next, connect the other end of the ribbon cable to the LCD screen module, and then connect the other end of the USB cable to the old droid board. Next, we will mount the LCD screen module to the front of the top half of the case. Installing the USB hard drive cable is optional if you plan to install a small drive in the case.
Make sure all cables are secured inside and mount the bottom half to the top half of the case. Next, we will press and securely the case locks around the USB ports in the front of the case. Next, stick on the rubber padding on the bottom of the case. Alright guys, we're all done here. What do you think? To me it looks pretty cool. Next, we'll test this bad boy with some emulators and some ROMs and see if it outperforms the Raspberry Pi. Please subscribe and give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Thanks for watching old school gamers. Mahalo.